Hello and welcome back to another snapshot video. So for this week, um, it's the 18th week, and so it's 12w18a. And in this, there's been a few features. Um, and the first feature is that multiplayer is becoming more like single player. So you can't really see it at the moment. But when you download this, you'll also have to download the server jar, and that means you don't have. They won't have to um, like implement it for the server and the client. So it's easier to implement things. So in single player. Um, you'll notice there are now like survival mode cheats and it will show you whether you've got cheats and things so I'm just gonna head on here so and what they're trying to do is they're trying to make it more like uh, multiplayer so you can like invite friends to your single player world and stuff like that and um, one of the new features is that there's uh, more stuff in the F3 menu now um, to be specific. There's WS, which I don't know what it means, um, F, S, and G. I know what G means. G means whether you're on the ground. So I'm just going to show you. So see G just here. And if when I jump, if I'm not on the ground, this is true and false and stuff. And so that's. Uh, I'm not sure what that will be used for, but oh well. Um, and I'm not sure what FS or FWS means, uh, but to get in straight away. So for starters, um, I'm just going to grab a diamond sword, going to grab some spawn eggs, going to grab a furnace, then I'm going to grab all these tools. So the first feature is now that. So you've just gone and. Um, your first day in Minecraft, and you've gone and collected. Um, Woods, you made a wooden pickaxe, and you don't actually need it again. You don't. Oh. Where's the coal gone? Oh, yeah, I didn't bring it coal. So you don't actually need these um, actresses again, so you're not sure what to do with them. So, say you want to smelt something, you can now put tools in, and they will act like uh, um, woods, because before you could not actually burn them. So from a tool, I'm, I'm going to get a diamond, nice, and you can put all the types of tools in. <coughs> so that's pretty cool, um, so you don't really need wood once you've got tons of stuff. The next feature is that when you spawn a villager, um, it will take a random profession. So if I spawn this, uh, I think that's a librarian, spawn this, I'm not sure what he is, uh, I'm not sure... So like you just get different pro professions now, so that's um, pretty good so you can actually decide which professions they are. So and the next feature is that um, one of the, sort of one of the coolest features, and it's sort of like um, the apples falling from trees. So if I just go ahead, I'll just destroy them, and I grow this. It makes a tree, and then if I'm just going to change my game mode 1 and then destroy this tree that should start degrading and I'm just gonna get another one over here just to make it quicker and as you can see there's cocoa beans cocoa no, rain. So let's just toggle down for them. So, yeah, cocoa beans now fall from trees, so they're a renewable source now. So that's pretty good. Um, so you can go and make those cookies. And the next feature is that because they're adding more multiplayer support, if you now go ahead and click T, type slash, click that, you've now got these like commands that you would normally have in the server. So I can Go and do the say command. So let's say hi guys. So and you'll say hi guy. Well, I did not sure I died. So that wasn't pretty. But that was pretty bad. And I wonder whether you can ban yourself. <laughs> You're banned from the server, even though I'm not on the server. That was a single player world. Yep, look, I've managed to ban myself from a single player world. <laughs> okay, 
Well, oh well, that's all the features I wanted to show you. So I hope you enjoy this, guys. And I wouldn't do that if I were you. You'll just get ban yourself from your own single player world. So, thanks for watching, and bye.